Hi, Mom. Yeah. No, can you pick up Chris after school? Yeah, I'm, I'm at the doctor's. Mrs. Harris? Describe your symptoms. H hang on. Stress, headaches, nausea. Well, I work on Saturdays. And how long has this been? Equanimity. Balance your lifestyle. Good morning, Dr. Sex. This is Bounder Beebe in Dallas, Texas. Tell me, what do you know that I need to know? I got a little bit of time with you. Well, you know, I, I think it would be great if we can help people understand, uh, you know, how to get from where they are now to becoming more aware to getting an assessment and getting a treatment because uh, this really has a lot to offer patients if they can make those steps. Uh, people who are right now suffering uh, may really get some relief. And they're suffering from what? You know, the, the idea of bipolar disorder, this is, you know, a lifetime condition. And it's something that can be confusing because the episodes alternate with being well, and it can be confusing to people because, you know, the symptoms differ from time to time that they have it. They may differ from somebody else that they heard about having this illness, and they wonder what's going on. Is this really just because, you know, a stress occurred in, in, in their life? And, you know, I think a lot of time is lost and people end up losing important relationships, jobs, et cetera, and their self-esteem and confidence go way down. What is uh, the prescribed course of getting back on track? Yeah, you know, we want people to start with awareness. And when we build from awareness to, hey, there may be really a good reason uh, to get a professional evaluation, we get somebody into the office, we have their... Uh, their family members or friends come with them who can uh, help us get a more complete picture of what's going on. We make the diagnosis and we offer them uh, a proven treatment for the condition that they have. And we can see as we do that that we're going to get a good number of people better. And sometimes when uh, people are lucky, that, that's great, that's all they need. But other times, you know, we may need to go through that treatment and assessment cycle a few times to find what's going to work for them. They may, may need to add self-management strategies, psychosocial interventions. But the good news is that we almost always get people back to, to normal. And that, that's a wonderful thing for patients when it happens. Those family members, those people who are suffering, who are listening, where would you send them on the web to find out more information? Yeah, you know, I, I really like the Depression and Bipolar Support Alliance website. Uh, this is a patient-led uh, organization, and it has a lot of, of local resources, but their website has terrific information and opportunities to track your mood, and, and I, you know, I, I highly recommend that. So you could put Depression and Bipolar in a search engine, and you'll find that website very easily. Doctor, thank you for talking about a much-needed, talked-about subject on the Valder BB Show. It's been my pleasure. Thank you. I appreciate the chance to get the word out with you.